students, let us continue with chapter 8 quadrilaterals. We'll take a look at another condition for a quadrilateral to be a parallelogram, uh, which is stated in theorem 8.8 .8, that if in a quadrilateral a pair of opposite sides are parallel and equal, then the quadrilateral is a parallelogram. So let us first go and prove this theorem. What we will do is we will draw a parallelogram. Sorry, we'll draw a quadrilateral. A, B, C, D, this is a quadrilateral in which let's say one pair of opposite sides are equal and parallel. So I'll say A, B is equal to D, C as well as A, B is equal to D, C. I need to prove that quadrilateral A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. So let us first write the given data and then go ahead and prove. So I'll say given quadrilateral A, B, C, D in quadrilateral ABCD, I'll say given, in quadrilateral ABCD, AB is equal to CD and AB is parallel to CD. To prove that quadrilateral ABCD is a parallelogram. So let's see how we will do this. If I join points D and B in order to form diagonal DB, I get two triangles, triangle ADB and triangle CBD. Now, in these two triangles, angle ABD is equal to angle CDB because AB is parallel to CD is given, therefore these form a pair of alternate angles. We have these two sides equal and this as the common side. Therefore, the two triangles ADB and CDB are congruent to each other by side angle side test of congruence. So, I will say prove join points B and D to draw diagonal BD. In triangle ADB and triangle CBD, I have angle ABD is equal to angle CDB, alternate angles for parallel lines. A, B and C, D, right? Also, I will say that A, B is equal to C, D. So, A, B is equal to C, D. This is given. And D, B is equal to B, D. They are the common side for both the triangles or it is the common side for both the triangles. Therefore, my two triangles are congruent, that is triangle ADB is congruent to triangle CBD by side angle side test of congruence. So, once you prove that these two triangles are congruent, what can you say? That angle ADB is equal to angle CBD by corresponding pair of congruent triangles. Therefore, angle ADB is equal to angle CBD and I'll say CP, CT but these are a pair of alternate angles for lines AB and CD. If you notice they form a Z over here. Therefore, AD is parallel to BC. I'll mark this as 1. Also, I have AB is parallel to CD. This is given. I'll mark this as 2. Therefore, what can I say from 1 and 2? That quadrilateral ABCD is a parallelogram. So, from 1 and 2, quadrilateral ABCD is a parallelogram. And I'll say hence proved. 
Why? Because what we are getting in quadrilateral ABCD, that AB is parallel to CD and AB is parallel to BC. Therefore, it is a parallelogram since the opposite uh, sides are parallel to each other. Therefore, it is sufficient to prove that given any pair of sides, let's say AB and CD, parallel as well as equal, you can simply say that the quadrilateral so form, in our case it is quadrilateral ABCD, so form is a parallelogram. So this was another condition before we proceed with exercise 8.1, which we will do in the next videos. Thank you. Hope this video increased your knowledge. For more such videos and a completely free educational content, log on to www.epathshala.org or visit our Epathshala YouTube channel. We have each and every question solved for maths, physics, chemistry and biology. So subscribe our channel, share with your friends, like our Facebook page and follow our Twitter handle for regular updates and important educational tips and also win Epathshala goodies. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe this channel and enjoy the freedom of education.